Hello everyone, it's the Upform team over here, and today we're going to show you guys how you can start better using Qualtrics. Specifically for today, we are going to go over how you can start distributing your forms to respondents through a QR code. Now, for those of you who might not know, QR codes are a really great way for you guys to start distributing your forms, especially if, let's say, your respondents have a device upon which they can start reading QR codes. It's a really simple way to do it. It doesn't take much effort from the respondent side. And when you're on Qualtrics, it's also really easy for you to install. Now, as you can see, we're just on the dashboard and we're just going to open one of our forms that we're going to add a QR code to so that respondents who have access to a QR code will now be able to basically answer the form. So here you just open one of our active forms and while we're on the survey editing page, we're going to want to head over to distributions over here. So distributions should be located beside workflows and data and analysis, just in case you don't know. And here it's going to show you how many responses you already have. And while we went over the anonymous link before, if you were to head down, scroll down a little bit more further, you'll see that there's a QR code option. Now, the great thing about Qualtrics is that they automatically create the QR code for you, meaning that you don't actually have to go to any third party website. The only issue is that when you're downloading a QR code, it's only done through a PNG, which is not usually readable for most formats unless you're planning to print it out physically. So in this case, you would have to convert it if you want to have it in other forms such as PDF or JPEG. But just note that it is possible. Download is really easy and you don't have to take a screenshot because the download will hap happen automatically. So let's just take a look at it so you guys know what it looks like. So yes, this is the QR code. And that's all you really have to say about this. Hopefully this helps you better manage any sort of data collection you might be doing. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Be sure to like and subscribe. And if you need any more help when it comes to Qualtrics or any similar data collection platform, be sure to check out the rest of our channel using either the link on the upper right corner of this video or any of the links below. See you next time.